For Sonia Hosfield, it's a weekly routine, but today, far from ordinary. Well, well, I'm upset. I can't believe that I have been coming here all these years and they post a sign like that. Her beloved grocery store, Price Chopper, has been a fixture on this corner for almost 20 years, but it's closing in two weeks and the news, a big surprise. I was just shocked. I couldn't believe it. It's always full. They are closing the best shop in the city and the best people, best team. We should get a big banner and march around and protest, but I guess it won't do any good. It's all a matter of money. She's right. The owner at Northwest Company says the store has been operating at a loss. It can't compete with nearby grocery giants Safeway, Sobeys, Walmart and Co-op. 60 staff were issued layoff notices this week. They'll be offered severance and transitional services to find new jobs. Tatiana Gajic says she's sad for the staff and she doesn't know where she'll be able to afford to shop now. I was literally in the shock. I'm on disability and I can't afford to buy in a superstore. I can't afford to buy in Sobeys and Safe my food. The Northwest Company has plans to turn this location into a giant tiger by early next year, but shoppers say it's no replacement. You don't buy groceries at Giant Tiger, at least I don't. The closure is just the latest blow to Manitoba's workforce. This week, Investors Group announced it's eliminating 30 positions in Winnipeg as part of countrywide job cuts. Great West Life is axing 450 jobs. Manitoba Hydro is reducing its workforce by 900 positions. One business expert says it's a symptom of a changing job market, not necessarily a suffering economy. But shopper Sonia Hosfield says her heart goes out to everyone impacted. When you hear of people being laid off everywhere in Winnipeg, I, I'm sad to uh, find that we can't resolve that here. It, it doesn't feel like it's my Winnipeg anymore. Jill Kubra, CBC News, Winnipeg.